Let's welcome Jeff and his science magic with a big round of applause. I'm Jeff Evans, and welcome to my Science Magic Assembly. Whether you're looking for a STEM program, a science fair kickoff, or a grand finale for your school science fair, this is a great way to do it. And the neat thing about no pop bubbles, you can collect them. And add that one to my collection. You're going to see some amazing things today, and if you see something you like, I want you to clap. In fact, go ahead and applaud right now. My job isn't necessarily teaching kids science as much as it is getting them excited and motivated to learn more about science on their own. What I've discovered is that anything that looks like magic can be explained by science. I'll see if you can guess what they are. Solids, liquids, and gases. Sun, do you know? Plasma, very good. I brought some carbon dioxide, but notice that I'm putting on some safety equipment, putting on a glove. This means that something awesome is about to happen. Here it is, the solid form of carbon dioxide. And it's commonly called what? Dry ice. When solid dry ice melts, do you think it becomes carbon dioxide liquid or carbon dioxide gas? And it looks very sciencey. So I take scientific principles like air pressure, density, static electricity, gravity, center of mass, things that we see every day, but I put them together in a way that looks magical, and then I explain the science behind it. what you expect to see, and you are correct. If it's less dense, it's gonna flow. Might be able to put a little fluffy cloud on top of the liquids. Down to the lake with this cannonball. Would it float or sink? fingers and go wiggle, wiggle, wiggle over the top of my balloon. <laughs> Wait. Go wiggle, wiggle, wiggle over the top of my hand. Go wiggle, wiggle, wiggle again. Top of the ladder in about one second to hit the ground. I'm gonna see if I am faster than the speed of gravity. One, two, three! High five. You guys were awesome. My name's Jeff Evans, saying thanks and goodbye.